so now I only have, you can count, I only have not 24 components, but I only have nitrogen down to C12 plus. Okay, it's my new model, my new fluid, which I call lump fluid, for example. Okay, and of course we need to match this new fluid, the lump fluid with the, the data. Okay, we will do matching again. And we can do that using this one matching. Okay, of course we will try to match the model with the data. Okay, here I want to match for the control components. I want to match the molar fraction. I want to match the oil viscosity. I want to match the oil density, critical point, molar fraction of gas, gas viscosity, and gas density. Okay, I want to match all these parameters because they are very, very important for me. Okay, and yeah, I will do the matching. You can use differential evolution, simplex method, particle swarm optimization, which I will use now. Maximum iterations, 10,000. You can stop on slow improvement. Yeah, so if the matching showed slow improvement then you can stop the iteration to to make the iteration faster number of iteration 1000 improvement value two percent so if there is no improvement greater than two percent i can stop the iteration and i can use the current iteration as my matching okay so sounds good points from yeah number of stage 20 minimum and maximum pressure 10 bars to 100 bars the temperature 100 okay so let's go run matching yeah again we want to create new lump variant that has to be matched so let's go to see the quality control Okay, this one molar fraction should be exactly the same before and after molar fraction also the same. So how can I tell they are the same because you cannot see the, the brown line. So it means they overlay exactly at the same place. Okay, but you can see if I maximize. Okay, for the density, they are quite match but not that match actually okay it it will be based on your computer of course okay based on your current matching which will be which will be different from one computer to other comp computer okay so this is the current quality control that i have i can accept it or I can also uh, I can rerun the matching. Okay, fingerprint plot. Okay, so the fingerprint plot show the molar fraction versus the molecular weight. So it's okay. Grading test, not not now. So again, you can decide whether you want to do rematching, or you can do you can accept it. For example, we want to do rematching. Okay, quality control. Can I do that? Close first. Okay. What do we have? The message here. The message here. Error in calculating grading test. Yes, of course. Again, we can go back to the this one lumping. Matching. Let's say stop on show slow improvement improvement let's say one percent okay run matching okay okay now i think it's better yeah okay so you know what i mean so we need we we must try to achieve matching so i think yeah we can accept this matching i can go back to this one to the components 
and you can use this one click this one add variant i will move it a little bit add variant now i want to use this lumping variant okay i want to accept the matching i'm quite satisfied with that and i want to call it because i do lumping for the light oil i will call it lumping matching variant for light click ok 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 so now i have lumping matching variant for the light condensate ok and i will rename it as light ok so yeah i will i will conclude later now i go to heavy the the match one the heavy one and i will do the same operation i want to do matching or uh, lumping sorry okay so for the this one i will i will not do manual lumping but i will use this operation which is very good auto lumping 